Hello and welcome to How Not to Draft Magic the Gathering. If you were here last time when I streamed that deck so bad, so terrible, so horrible, so absolutely putrific, that I made the claim that even the auto picker was able to draft a better deck than me. I figure let's go ahead and put that to the test. Alright, so as is the theme of this channel, do not try this at home. You will probably piss off a lot of people. Um, so actually... That looks like a pretty good card. I'd probably go with the Ether Channel on this one. I mean, normally I snap pick the rare anyway, but I figure I have cause to on this one. So I'm going with Ether Channeler on this one, just mainly because it's a rare. But also, it's got a really good ETB. Uh, you can choose whichever one you want. Auto select degrees. Uh, ooh, add a car waste, and it's on color, so yeah, I would definitely pick the pain land here. Um, it gives me the option to splash white or to just go double, uh, blue white. Crystal Grotto would be another good pick here to kind of do some mana fixing later on for kickers or whatnot. Uh, Tolarian Geyser, I don't know. Hydromancer's pretty cool. You can copy something. Baird, I don't know. Probably not. But I'd go with the Adakar Wastes. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. Cult Conscript is a really good card. It kicks my ass almost every time I come up against it. I would probably snap pick that one. If only so that nobody else could get it. I am certainly not above hate drafting. Although, since I am kind of leaning blue, Impulse is a great card. Negate, I mean, you really can't go wrong with counter spells. A 2 3 flying for 3, it's not the best, but I mean, it's something. I would probably go with Cult Conscript here, if only for the hate draft. Oh! Auto picker is going for Rulik Mons. All right. I'm probably not going to run that unless I mean it's possible we could. Uh, but that's like that's a bad pick. I would not have done that. Anyway, pilfer, pretty good. If we're going red green, we might as well go red green. Phalanx is pretty good. Juniper Order is okay. Herbalist is pretty good. Uh, let's see. Warhorse Enthrall to the Pit. Let's see, with no blue here, I would be inclined to probably go for Herbalist? Or the Wall. The Wall works too. Plaza of Heroes. Add one mana of any color only for a legendary. Add one mana of any color among legendary permanents you control. Well, I don't think I have any legendaries yet. Well, I guess I do have Rulik Mons. I mean, I suppose that works with whatever. But anyway, uh, let's see. Warhorse Frenzy. That's a pretty good... Ooh, I do like him. Splatter Goblin would go along with the... Except it's black. Meteorite, Tortoise, Steel Crusher, Apparition. I don't know. I mean, okay, it's going to go with the rare, of course. I don't really know if that's the best pick, but hey, it's the auto picker. What can you do? Weather Seed Treaty. Not terrible. It starts out with Search for a Land. Uh, let's see, Drawbridge is pretty good. Impulse is once again pretty good. I don't really know what colors I'm going yet, so I can't really take that into account. So I would probably honestly go for the Mire or the Treaty. No? Prodigy? Okay. 
looks like we're kind of delving into green, so I would probably pick the gardener here. Bog Badger is really good, like as as like a finisher. Thrill of possibility, discard a card to draw two. Keldon Strike Team. Nice if you can kick it. Inscribe tablet lets you tutor a land. So tablet would be really good for hitting domain. Oh, we're going with the badger. Uh, this one is going to pick Thran Portal because it's a rare. I already know that. Um, but... Eesh, that's kind of a bad saga, isn't it? Anyway... Let's see, Negate, Warhorse, Hammer Hand. Mana Worker's a good filter. Um, let's see, what do we got here? Enthralled to the Pit. Aggressive Sabotage is probably the best pick here, but I'm not really into black. I'm mostly green, but there's no green here. So I'd probably end up with War Brute since it looks like we're going with the Rulik Mons plan. And Fall to the Pit's pretty good, but you gotta kick it. Nope, we're going with the Cavalier. Alright. Once again, I would probably take the War Brute, maybe the Sentry. Um, because if we're going with the Rulik Mons plan, that would be the way to go. And since we're, we've been picking Heavy Green, so... Nope. All right. Baird it is. Negate, Marius Outrider, Yavamaya Sojourner, or Mana Worker. Once again, Mana Worker with that filter ability is really good for hitting kickers. If nothing else, Outrider, okay. I think we're picking a red card here. Uh, I'm not entirely sure, but I think I'm going with a red card here. Kavu, really? Steel Crusher. And another Kavu. Alright. Pack 2. Defiler of Flesh. Ooh, that's a good reason to, to go black. Because I have absolutely no black yet, so... Jesus. Uh, Skyrider, Hurler Cyclops. Okay. Another Benelish Sleeper. Let's see, Timely Interference. That's pretty good. Phyrexian Rager. Flowstone Infusion. Hammer Hand. Some Dual Lands. Bark Weave Crusher. And another Mary's Outrider. Alright, well, it's gonna go with Defiler of Flesh because it's the rare. Let's see. We've got... I don't know if I can just splash black for that, though. That's a lot of black to splash. Power's equal to basic land types. Nishiba Brawler. I mean, we're going pretty much five colors, so he actually might be pretty good. Uh, whenever a creature dies, draw a card if it was attacking. Otherwise, he deals one damage. I and mean, that's pretty good. Toxic A-Bomb. Apparition is really good. Soul Tender is pretty good. Herbalist. Lightning Strike Worm. Um, I would probably start splashing black. I'd probably go with Garna. Maybe Tender or Apparition. Probably Garna. Okay, Lightning Strike. That sounds, yeah, sure, why not? Cleaving Skyrider. Flash Flying. It's pretty good, but I'm not really in white. Uh, the only one I've got is Cavalier. Uh, let's see, Pill for Dragon Whelp is pretty good red. Once again, I'm not in white, even though those are really good cards. Impulse, Apparition, War Brute, Strike Team. Thrill of Possibility, Meteorite, Tortoise. Um, I might go Apparition for this Black Splash. Probably War Brute or Dragon Whelp. I'd probably go Dragon Whelp for the flying fire breathing or sky rider okay probably not gonna go white 
Okay, what do we got here? We've got Combat Research, Juniper Order, Talus Lookout, pretty good. But I'm really not in blue anymore. Aggressive Sabotage, Phyrexian Rager, Vivisector's really good, Abomination, Viachino Branch Rider. Oh, that's cool. That looks like a really good um, early play, possibly even into the late game. I would probably go with... Oh, the lookout. Okay, sure. Not what I would have done. Uh, Yotia declares war. Eh. Heroes Heirloom, Vanguard, Impulse, Soaring Drake, Sojourner, Broken Wing, Hammer Hand. Barricade is really good and so is Sabotage. Um, I would probably go for Barricade here, although it looks like we're sticking with the red-green. Um, oh, Hero's Heirloom? Alright, sure, whatever. Uh, Vanquisher's Axe. Gaia's Might would be pretty good. Kavu, again. Uh, let's see, Joint Exploration... Najal, whenever you cast, you cast sorceries as Splash, copy it. That's pretty good in a, a spells deck. Uh, not a spells deck, so I don't know why I'm taking it. I really don't have blue. Alright, once again we've got Balmor, really good in a spells deck, but I'm not really a spells deck. Uh, let's see, Shadow Prophecy, okay, Flowstone Infusion, Keldon Strike Team, Warbrute, I'd probably go for Warbrute, possibly guys might, but Warbrute would be my pick here. Nope, we're going for Battle Mage. Alright. Artillery, Stalfer Time, Academy of Wall, Geyser, Flowstone Infusion, I would probably take Sentry here. Okay, Hurler, Cyclops, Hammer Hand, Flowstone Infusion, some blue cards, and a white card. So I would go for the Cyclops. Another Garna. So, or that might be the same Garna, just wheeled around. So, I mean, that might be a pretty good pick here. Um, or possibly Fire Nato. Once again, we've got Warbrute, would probably be my pick here. Nope, we're going to stall for time. Alright, well, we'll kick that down there. Uh, Branch Rider would be my pick here. Nope. Um, Alright. I've probably gone for the Hammer Hand, but whatever. Ooh, the red payoff, Shiv and Devastator. We are definitely taking that. That might be the only actual worthwhile card we draft. What else is in here, just for giggles? The Fury Rider. Vanguard, Battle Rage. Tide Pool Turtle. Impede Momentum's really good. Griffin Protector. Goblin Picker, Vine Shaper and some dual lands. Yeah, Devastator is definitely going to be the pick here. It is really the only possible pick here. Alright, so we've got Silver Scrutiny. -y. I mean, Auto Picker's going to pick it because it's rare. I would probably go for Lagamos. But the... Uh, other the Garna wheeled around, so maybe Lagamos will too. I would probably go for Welp here. And trust Lagamos to wheel around. Balduvian Atrocity. ETB, if it was kicked, return a creature with mana three or less from graveyard to the battlefield. Gains haste and sacks. That's not bad for four. 
All right, so Atrocity is going to be pretty high on my list here. Shore Up, Meteorite, Keldon Strike Team, Soul Tender, Axe. I, I think Atrocity is pretty much the only pick here. Stall for Time? Okay. Uh, Branch Rider, that's a really good one. I'd probably go... Uh, definitely one of these here. Rager, Branch Rider, Colossal Growth, or Root Walla. Possibly Root Walla just to get some more on the, the lower end. Or Branch Rider to get some one drops. Probably Branch Rider just for the one drop. Um, possibly some dual lands to get some mana fixing. I know I've got some black and green, so Haunted Mire would be a really good pick. But nope, we're going with the Rager. Alright. Uh, let's see. Shoot. White, 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 blue. So, Urborg Repossession, Furious Bellow, Thrall to the Pit. I mean, I do kind of like the Mind Control and then Sack. I'd probably go for Urborg Repossession on this one. Or a Talarian Terror, sure. Uh, Weather Seed Treaty, Bone Splinters would be a pretty good one. Uh, probably Coalition Warbrute would be my go again here. Actually, I'd probably take the land, because I'm going to need some mana fixing. I have absolutely, like, none. Okay, Pilfer? Not bad. Battle Rage Blessing, Death Touch and Indestructible, not bad. Vivisector, also pretty good. A solid two-drop. Um, I would probably go Vivisector off of this one. Nope, we're going to Pilfer. Codex is really good. Let's see, we're not really in blue. Furious Bellows, decent. Picker, eh. I would probably take Badger, maybe Sojourner. Nope, Bellow it is. Let's see, I would definitely be taking Geothermal Bog here. The only other real option would be the Battlefly Swarm because of the Death Touch. Makes it kind of solid. And Lagamos did wheel. So that's good for us. So I would definitely snap that one because that's what I was hoping for. But we're going with the Badger. Alright. Did not see that coming. Uh, this one I have no idea. I would probably go for the Soul Tender because of the Graveyard Recursion. Uh, once again, Branch Rider. I've, I kind of think that would help. But it's gonna. Oh, there we go. We got the Branch Rider. All right. I think I'm gonna take a red card here. I'm not sure which one. Sure, we'll bellow, and possibility. All right. So we ended up with a mostly red green. Um, we'll get rid of that one. Uh, let's see, we have one that's multicolor, red, white, Baird, so we'll kick him out. Uh, let's go ahead and toss some blacks back in. Alright, so that's 45, so we'll just go ahead, god. So I need to cut five cards, and I've got... Alright, what do we got here? Flowstone, that needs green kicker, blue kicker. Black Kicker. Do I have any legend? Really, any legendaries? Just the one, two. So I've only got the two legendaries. So Plaza of Heroes, I don't really think does much. It does look. It, it does give me the black for Garna. So that's one thing. So I guess it's good for that reason. It's basically another swamp for Garna, or it's a mountain forest for Rulik. I guess we can keep it in. It does do something. Pilfer's good if only for the reveal. That's basically just a 2-2 two, two for 2 because I don't really have a blue kicker or a way to make a blue kicker unless I Thran Portal as an island. So we'll just go ahead and take him out. So that's 10, 15, 17 lands. Okay. 
I need to keep my top end because I need to keep my top end. Whether she treaty searches for a land, which I definitely want. Yocha declares wars. Create two thopters. Tap any number of artifacts to deal that much damage to target creature or planeswalker, which those are the only artifacts I have. And then I can make an artifact into a 4-4. So... I would have to wait three turns and hope that my Thopters survive to to make a 4-4, four, four. but I don't know. I'm, I think I'm going to take it out. I do like the Destroy Artifact. We're keeping that in there. Discard to draw two, sure. We'll keep that in there. Uh, Shivan Devastator, yeah, that's crap. We can go ahead and throw that away, right? No, maybe not. All right, we'll keep it in. I do like that for the the land fixing. Heirloom I suppose we can get rid of. Ikavu I could only really use it twice to make a 4-1 menace. We'll go ahead and drop Ikavu, sure. And that'll give us 40. So this is our auto draft deck. Let me know if you agree or if I maybe should have done Red Blue, because I do have Chandler, which is really good. Silver Scrutiny. Uh, the Attacar Waste could have helped out if I could have gone Blue Red, is possible. Uh, I don't really know how how spellsy I could have been. Um, so I don't really think it would have done very well. So I'm at seven non creatures. Five instants, one sorcery. So that would have been six or seven, eight. So that would have been eight total spells in a blue red spells deck. I don't necessarily think that would have been enough to cut it. So that's kind of why I didn't go for the blue red spells. And instead, we're going uh, Jund, I think. Yeah. I don't know, the tricolors are, are always kind of weird for me. So yeah, we'll give this a shot, see what happens. Um, I mean, it couldn't be worse than last week, right? Alright, we've got red and black in hand. Shit. No turn one play, no turn two play. I really should throw this away. Start off with the pilfer. Oh, Talarian Terror, or we'll get rid of Defiler of Dreams. Sure, that seems like a good pick. Are you kidding? Come on, you gotta give me something here. Seriously, no fucking lands. Scry 2, draw 1, okay. Alright, well that's not what this is meant for, but... I mean... Oh fuck, he's got- God damn it! God fucking damn it, I knew he had that too. I am such a fucking idiot. God damn it. Alright, well, my uh... Hopes for this deck aren't very hopeful. Oh, 
Alright, well, we got something. It probably ain't gonna do much for us, but it's something. Is he gonna bounce it, or is he gonna kill it? <laughs> He's gonna do the same thing I did. Yeah, and then drop a terror, sure, why not. Oh, I fucking milled my Devastator. I am devastated. Well, we'll give it a shot. It might work, it might not. Uh, yeah, I don't really need to land, I need action. Oh, fuck! Fuck me! God damn it! I fucking had it! He didn't have a response. I had the block. I could have just fucking taken it out. But no, I'm a fucking idiot. And now I fucking lose two plus the spell. What the fuck is wrong with me? Yeah, I can't. I just, I've fucked this up. Ten ways I can't win this shit. So yeah, if you see anything that I do, anything that I fuck up really bad like that, please put it in the comments below and absolutely make fun of me because I deserve it for that. What the fuck? I'm going up against a gold opponent? I'm fucking bottom of the barrel silver going up against a fucking gold opponent? What the fuck? No, we're gonna throw that back. Plus, I heroes again! Fuck that shit! Get that shit out of here! Alright, well, we gotta keep this one. I've got Garna, I've got Black. Uh, yeah, I'll fucking, fucking fuck me. God damn. We'll get rid of the forest, I guess. Shake it off, shake it off. You can do this. Shake it off. Hey, that's where my Lagamos went. How about an X3 Devastator? Um, well... Feels bad. I'm not gonna block the token that's just gonna die anyway. That's silly. This is not going good. Not going good at all. If I double block the Kavu, he can pump it. Oh, he's just going to fucking destroy it. Sure, why not? Alright. Yeah. I gotta fucking do something. A 
It's not doing good. And lightning strike. Yep. I mean, he's red black. He's gonna have removal. There's there's nothing about that. Yeah, there's... I'm dead. I'm just dead. I'm just straight up dead. He's got me dead on board. There's nothing I can do. Alright, let's see what happens. I know he's got something. There is no way I am not dead here. He has got to have something. Okay. Go ahead and clear the board. Or my board, at least. So he's about to have a six, three, six, five. Let's see, and Devastator can come down as, so I got three, four, five, six, as a six, six. So, I'm dead. One, two, three, four, five, six. X equals six. That's all I can do. And it's not enough. Yep. All right. Oh, and two. But, I mean, come on, you put me up against a fucking gold player. I'm not in the gold tier, I'm barely in the silver tier. What the fuck are you doing putting me up against a gold tier player? Alright, this is more like it. We, we got back to a bronze tier player. Alright, we're doing good now. Um, except Plaza of Heroes does shit, which means all I've got is two mana and a pilfer. I can't even do fucking those. So... Yeah, I can't keep... Alright, Thran Portal's better, but Jesus Christ. I guess we'll keep. I've got the the vine wall, at least I can search for a swamp. Oh, fuck me. So that'll get my third land, that'll get my fourth land, so I can drop Defiler, we'll kick Flowstone. Enters tapped unless I control... Okay, well, we'll... Enters tapped unless I control two or fewer other lands. So right now it would enter untapped. So we'll go ahead and start with green. I might draw more lands. And 
And I do. Looking for a swamp. Looking for a swamp. Got a swamp. I think I'll just take the two. Okay, so... We're gonna go ahead and... Swamp. Treaty. On one. Because I want that land tutor. And I'm gonna grab me a swamp number two. Alright, well he's got some kind of pump up his sleeve. Otherwise he wouldn't just straight up attack in, so... It doesn't matter what we block, Videnwald's gonna die. No, he's not gonna pump? Alright. Oh, nice. Shuffle the chosen cards into the library and put the rest into the hand. Okay. So he's going to grab four cards, and I pick the two that I don't want him to have. Alright, well, we'll go ahead and pick those two and put those back in. Alright, so now I get a sapperling. I'm going to go ahead and put out my Thran portal as an island to add to my domain. I am then going to Defiler, but not Swarm because that doesn't make any sense yet. I don't really have anything to attack with, so we'll just go ahead and end turn. Okay. Gains plus X and trample where X is the number of land types. So we'll go with the sapperling, might as well. Let's see, we'll draw up a forest, I suppose. We'll go ahead and kick the badger. And we will battle fly. Ah, normally. Uh, plus one and menace. So we'll go with the sapling again. And we'll just attack with the sapling. So by attacking with defiler, he's gonna put gardener in front of it and kill it. in with a all right sure what you got over there oh you don't want me to know all right sure Uh, let's see, we will go ahead and move on to combat. He doesn't have his Death Toucher anymore. He could he could multiple block to get rid of the Defiler of Flesh. But 
So if she puts everything in front of Defiler, I still think that's, you know, a, a win for me, right? I mean, sure. I mean, Badger is definitely not the threat here. I mean, I suppose as a 3-3, it's more of a threat than the, the Battlefly Swarm, but still. Okay, that's bad for me. I think I'm going to keep my swarm back on defense if he swings in with the sentry. So if I attack with the swarm, he'll block with the spider, and then I'll trade a 1 1 for a 1 3 when he's still got that 4 4 out. So I think I'm going to actually pass on everything. I'll just go to his turn. Alright. Oh, he kicked it, so he gets a soldier, too. Oh, two soldiers. That's not good for me. Is he going to attack? Nope. We'll go ahead and thrill now. Discarding my mountain. And draw two cards. One of which is a Yavamaya Steel Crusher, which does absolutely nothing. It's just a 2-2 two -two for two. All right. And once again, we're just going to pass. Are you going to attack me? Nope. Alright. So we'll go ahead and drop the Menace Kavu. I think he's sandbagging the land the same as I am. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, I don't know how I beat that. It's possible he has a counterspell. If he does, I'm fucked. Two, four, six, X equals seven. And it resolves. All right, um, we'll go ahead and attack with him, though. He doesn't have enough reachers to kill it. If I were him, I'd chump. Oh, fuck, he does have enough. God damn it, I forgot about Snare Spinner. Fuck me again. And a grow. What the hell? Now, I thought he would have thrown that pump spell out a long time ago. So, I mean, GG opponent, you got me. I mean, you fucking got me. Like, there's. Yeah.
That's just some silly. Yeah, I should. Yeah, he's got menace, so you have to block with both of them. So now is when he just swings in and just murders me. Alright, so what now? What do we got? Five, 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 seven. Can I? I can pump him once to a three X. Which isn't enough to fucking kill anything. So we'll go ahead and chump there. Chump there. Nope, nope, nope. I've already got him blocked. Um... Sure, we'll do that. Oh, he gives up because he realizes that all I have to do is block and he dies. Ah, 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 okay. All right, with one win under our belt, we are going into game four. I suppose I could keep this. I do have the three mana to go find a mountain. Maybe I'll find a mountain somewhere on the way. And we'll see what Cyclops can do. Well, I got nothing else to do. Let's go ahead and pilfer. See what you got going on up there. Phasing of Zalfir. A board wipe would probably kill me. Oh, Jesus. Or I don't have anything to deal with the wealth, really. Um. I'm going to go with the dragon wealth, really. Because he might actually get to cast that. He is still too blue away from phasing of Zalfair. Okay. I definitely want Soul Tender out before he Zalfirs. Ooh, Defiler. I like that too. What you got? You got some kind of instant in your hand. I know you do. You gonna bolt it? You gonna bolt the rager? Oh, that's an instant. That's what it's holding up on. Oh, his opponent got mana screwed. So, yep, that was a give me. But hey, it happens. It happened to me last video. So, I mean, a win's a win. Oh my god, this is bad. 
I've got Defiler, but I'm going to have to Thran Portal a Mountain just to get there. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'll pull a Mountain and I won't have to Thran Portal it. Hey, look, a Mountain. Well, let's go ahead and bring out the Swarm. Alright, so do I attack is the question. Nah. If I keep it back, I might stop him from attacking. Or he might just bolt it. Bolt the bug? Is that our new saying? Should I just take it? This time I'll select blockers first. I'm doing this for the scry. That's what I'm saying. Oh, I'm making him use a removal. Haha, <laughs> yes. That is a win, because now he can't use that on Defiler. Uh, we will go ahead and drop the Swamp. Actually, should I drop the Forest? Because that'll let me... Well, that's a turn four, that's a turn four. I'd rather Defiler first and then Badger anyway, so we'll go ahead... Well, if I'm going to turn 4, I'm going to use the Thran Portal. So yeah, we'll put that on Forest. We'll Soul Tender. Take the hit. And Mill Devastator again. What the fuck? How does Soul Tender get Devastator every goddamn time? That is some horse shit. I might as well go ahead and block it because, I mean, he's of more danger when he can start enlisting things. The Frexion Rager is always going to be a 2-2. Uh, we'll go ahead and drop Defiler. Well, yeah, we'll take a point of damage from the portal. There's really no point in kicking Bog Badger at this point because the Defiler is the only thing I have out, which already has Menace. You're gonna make me discard two cards. Alright, well. I'll definitely discard Thrill of Possibility. Um, do I want the Swamp for Soul Tender or do I want the Badger? I think I want the Swamp actually. Well, that does nothing. We'll go ahead and drop the swamp and the turn, see what he's got going, and we'll soul tender afterwards. Squee, whenever it attacks, create a goblin. Just create a goblin. All right, sure. Yep, you get a goblin. All right, so end of turn, we will eerie soul tender to get back my devastator. One, two, three, four, five. I can X equals five at the moment. That seems pretty good. 
Although it sucks playing him as a defender. But that might stop Squee from attacking. Because I am kind of getting low on life here, and that's going to add up. Oh god, especially with that shit. Alright, well, maybe I should have attacked, I don't know. No, he stops, alright. Well, I don't really think I'm going to get out of this one. Um... Not if I keep drawing lands, anyway. Give me some action. Well, not like that. You little fucker. Well, that does it. Yeah, nothing I can do against that. Alright, that does it for this draft. We hit our three losses. Although I do think I could have won game one had I not just punted that shit out of fucking nowhere. That was not a problem with the deck. That was a problem with the pilot. So, game one notwithstanding, I probably should have won that game. So we'll say three wins on this deck versus last week's deck where I got one win and three losses. Uh, so yes, we have now proven that the auto picker can make a better deck than me so if you were wondering why i called this channel how not to play it's because i have absolutely no fucking clue what i'm doing and you should not model after me in any way shape or form and that's our moral for the day so if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe please comment down below any of the mistakes that i made and there were many and I will see you in the next video.